New tonight, it's been more than three years since a series of horrific events unfolded at Taunton Silver Sil City Galleria, where 56-year-old George Heath was stabbed to death. Heath was trying to stop a man from stabbing a pregnant waitress at Bertucci's that night when he lost his life. Now a motorcycle run honors Heath's memory. Eyewitness News reporter Kim Kalunian joins us in Taunton, where the third annual motorcycle run took place today. A beautiful day for a ride. Oh, George would never give me a, sh a rainy day, ever. Rosemary Heath remembering her husband Sunday as motorcyclists gather in Taunton for the third annual George Heath Memorial Run, a fundraiser and a tribute to a man who lost his life, saving another's. It's wonderful to honor him in, in such a way. And for those people that knew him as a friend, this is a very, very emotional day. Um, for those people who didn't know them, I hope they take away from this what a wonderful guy he was and how much he meant to all of us. The money from this year's run will go to Taunton High School seniors. Rosemary says they'll take nominations and pick two students from each of the city's five schools to receive money from the George Heath Superhero Scholarship. Heath lost his life as he attempted to save a pregnant waitress from a man wielding a knife at the Silver City Galleria in May of 2016. Rosemary hopes this annual event will keep George's legacy alive. Oh, I think it reminds everybody of, of what his sacrifice was and um, that he didn't think about doing it, he just did it. So um, not even questioning whether he would make it out of there alive or not, he just did it. So I think that that would be the, the hope that other people would stand up when they, when they need to. In Taunton, Kim Kalunian, Eyewitness News.